I played in the backs a lot when, you know, underage and even coming into the Kilkenny setup as well. And I suppose last year I was kind of given that kind of opportunity to play in the forwards for the kind of first few rounds of the league. Um, and I suppose then it kind of, I kind of had to brush up on my shooting a small bit. So, uh, look, I have, a, I have an unusual striking uh, action as well. Uh, I kind of throw the ball over the hurl when I'm striking it. So I don't know if that kind of helps the way I strike the ball. But, um, yeah, no, look, I... I've been practicing there kind of more so probably the last 12 months because of that stint in the forwards. Paddy Deegan, great hockey player. Whether he's in the black and amber jersey or the green and white of his club, he lashes it, dropping it down and dropping it over the bar. That's Paddy Deegan. If we believe that the shot is on, you take it. So I suppose some of them are a good distance out, so a lot of people probably wouldn't look at it and, and shoot, but... Uh, I probably when I am striking, I'm I'm confident that it, that I will score. Yeah. Here comes Paddy Deegan. He's already on four points, just inside the 65 meter line. He steps away. He knows he hit it sweetly and straight over the black spot. Five points for the centre half back and the Kilkenny star. That was a great day, I suppose. Um, I suppose the way they set up, they they drop back to field a good bit, and I was left free for probably a good bit of it, and I suppose. Normally, as a centre back, if you're kind of left free, you kind of sit. But I think with with the likes of Huey and Mikey behind me, I, I'm I, I'm confident that I can push forward that bit more, and that's probably why I was getting myself into positions that that I could actually shoot from. So I suppose that confidence in our in our backline as a as a whole gave me the opportunities. It's like you only have a short window to play GAA at at the the highest level, I suppose. So look, there's probably only about 10, 10 years that you actually get to play at the at the very highest level. So you make the most of it when you're there and look, you enjoy every moment of it and in a few years' time it's going to be gone so you can do whatever you want then. I'm teaching in Clare National School. It's out, out the road. It's about 10 minutes out the road. So it's a, it's a lovely country school. It's about 200 pupils in it. So uh, the principal, Richie Mulroney, he was, he was manager of the Kenny Minor team for a few years there as well. So he understands if... I need a, a day, a couple of days maybe to go on tra on a training camp or whatever. So he's very he's very accommodating in that sense. And look, like you said, the job the job suits. But it probably wasn't the primary reason that I actually went down that road. I look, I, I really enjoy it, and I enjoy the the fact that the kids don't take life too serious. So you're kind of going in there, and they're they're not holding back when whenever you have a bad game anyway.